Homer becomes the hunted. The sub-episode starts with Homer receiving a hunting invitation from Mr. Burns. Right off the bat, his family begs him not to go. However, Homer does not listen. He and several others arrive at Mr. Burns' mansion. Mr. Burns says that all of them will participate in the most dangerous game. The most dangerous game? What could it be? Like any stereotypical human hunting trope, Mr. Burns gives his guests a five minute head start. They run for their lives while Mr. Burns shoots them one after another with a smile. Of course, it becomes more enjoyable if it goes on live TV with reporters narrating to the audience what's happening. Lisa and Marge see this, understandably making them worried. I should have known something was wrong when we got this week's TV guide. Six hours have passed and only six of them are left. Mr. Burns arrives in a plane and strikes at them, leaving Homer alone. Homer tries to trick Mr. Burns, but he falls from the tree he's hiding from. When the hunter is about to shoot. Marge arrives to hit him and Smithers in the head with a pan. Homer thanks his wife for saving him and they start doing things that shouldn't be on live TV. But now you know.